everybody. Today what we're going to do is we're going to try and use the vacuum chamber uh, to help the resin spread throughout the silicone mold. Uh, which isn't the main purpose of the vacuum chamber. The main purpose was to uh, help degas the silicone mold. Um, I haven't had a chance to try that yet, but uh, this will hopefully be a, a secondary use for it. Um, so when we come back, we will be zoomed in much closer. Uh, Alright, should be at least mostly hardened or at least as spread out as it's going to get. Hopefully I didn't mess my vacuum chamber up. I uh, definitely <laughs> used far too much resin. Um, it made a bit of a mess, but uh, hopefully it won't be a big deal. Oh, hard as a rock. Hmm. So it says we have a bit of time before it's time to demold. Top of the tire. I just hope it went all the way through. Yeah, we're gonna wait a few more minutes. Well, it didn't come out too bad. It's the right shape and everything, at least all the way this time. But as you can see, this isn't quite right. It's got some pitting. Pretty close though. Pretty close. And uh, did another one of these as well. Let's see how it turned out. Well, my rubber band won't be doing any more of these tonight. Come on, plastic, get off of me. Didn't need any demolding uh, stuff this time, at least. It didn't turn out so good last time, so I decided not to put any. This could use some more trimming. Mm, I've seen better. Alright, this one came out pretty good. Just not perfect. You can see there's a hole and another hole at the top. Hole through the middle came out pretty good. And after I hit it with the saw, this side came out pretty good. Almost perfect.